Bearing capacity failure is where the subgrade is not strong enough to withstand the load from the embankment. The structure sinks and the subgrade heaves out to either side. A geosynthetic reinforcement layer improves the bearing capacity of the subgrade and changes the failure mode. Sliding failure is where the friction between the embankment and the subgrade is low and the embankment can simply slide sideways. Interfriction between the geosynthetic and the soil surface should be obtained from testing. Rotational stability, also known as global stability, is the most common failure mode. Part of the embankment simply drops away because the weight of the soil is too much for the subgrade to bear. This generally occurs after severe storms when rain infiltration affects the soil properties. The geosynthetic layer intercepts the slip failure surface. It extends the potential slip circle deeper into the foundation. Here are some startling examples of rotational stability failures. The scale of failures can be immense, with catastrophic consequences including loss of life. When designing embankments, considerations include the undrained shear strength of the existing soil, the weaker the soil, the stronger the reinforcement required. Properties of the imported backfill. This influences the friction characteristics between the backfill and the geosynthetic reinforcement. The combination of these two elements must be optimized to design a structure with the best possible geometry, for example, narrow base with stable, steep slopes. Selection of the geosynthetic material itself. Each product has different properties that the engineer must understand, such as strength reduction factors for installation damage, environmental damage, and manufacturing process. The applied forces, such as the geometry of the embankment, dead load, and the vehicle load it must support. Here we return to an example of a bund wall being built on a soft seabed. A high strength geotextile reinforcement layer is placed on the seabed. A single layer of 800 kilo Newton geotextile is used in this instance. Multiple layers of 